Alrighty guys, here's the new setup. Looking pretty good, huh? Alright, we're gonna switch over to the camera. That looks amazing. Jake, what do you think of the new camera? Looks pretty good. <laughs> so today's not actually a training day, it's Thursday, it's rest day. But I got this new camera and I just wanted to show you guys the new camera. So I'm gonna end the vlog for today here, but we're gonna pick up tomorrow morning. Tomorrow's comp training day, it's gonna be awesome. We'll see you in the morning. <laughs> Morning. Wow, great thing to walk into. In morning. Morning. Good morning. Morning. <laughs> Update. I definitely need a haircut. What up? Dude, why'd you turn the music off? <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh. I upgraded from my old camera, which was the T5, to this camera for several reasons. One, it came with the mic, that shotgun mic, so it's directional pointing towards where it's shooting. That way it won't pick up a bunch of background noise, which I found to happen a lot when I was filming at the gym, like the fans blowing or just, just people talking, whatever. So this mic will help us out with uh, cutting out background noise. Also, a big upgrade for this camera is that it has this flip out screen. Boom. So I can see myself when I'm filming. So yeah, I'm holding it up right here, I can see myself. It's also a touch screen, which is awesome. And Lastly, the autofocus on this thing is amazing. My old camera, the autofocus was terrible. You'd have to like refocus the camera yourself and you could hear it focusing and it just wasn't what I wanted. So I went ahead and returned my old camera, picked up this new one. So hopefully the uh, quality of the vlogs start to improve, guys. I, the true nor strong and free. Yay! Dude, happy Canada Day. Happy Canada Day! Oh my god. Ow. Happy Canada Day, everyone. If you're watching in Canada, happy Canada Day. <laughs>the saying, sometimes you have to do stuff you really don't want to, applies perfectly to me right now because I have to go dress up in this monkey suit, drive all the way to work just for a one hour lunch meeting with the interns. I know it's my job, it's, it's what I'm supposed to do, but normally I have Fridays off and I don't really want to get dressed up and all this stuff and drive all the way down to work just just for a one hour lunch meeting but sometimes you got to do stuff you don't want to do two hours later so me and jake just played call of duty one verse one loser has to do 10 burpees <laughs> yeah baby knock them out <laughs> all right round two coming up we'll see who wins Rep them out, baby! Rep them out! Woo two for two over here. C4 ready. Nice and cold. It's time to head to the gym. I'm psyched for tonight. Competition training is, is on Friday nights and it's always my favorite night because a big group of us gets together and we all throw down hard. It's kind of like a little mini competition. So to get that time lapse shot right there, I had my my gorilla pod strapped onto the side the side view mirror on my car, and I was just driving, and I got the weirdest looks when I was sitting in traffic. It was hilarious, and I passed a cop, so I ripped it off because I I didn't really know what a cop would think of it. So, oh well, we got the shot. Oh, no. Video. Oh, dude, what do you think of the new camera? 
It's awesome. Wait, is that the microphone? What up? Hello, hello, testing. You're not supposed to touch it. I'm sorry. That's okay. okay. Hello, hello, testing. Oh, testing. Jesse, test I have a question of the day. Sure. Okay. Would you rather win an Olympic gold medal or the CrossFit Games? Shit, they're like one and the same. That's a tough one. Um, Harder. Depends what the depends what the in weightlifting gold medal and weightlifting for your weight class um, and set a world record. I'd have to go with the games. All right. Yeah, it's more diverse. Than That's how you know he's a true CrossFitter. Yeah. <laughs> you too. Yeah. Like had to do it. They were out of my favorite flavor, Kool Aid, so I had to get a different flavor this time. I'll let you know how it is. Ugh. Stuff smells like cherry cough syrup. So first movement we're doing tonight is called an ice cream maker. It uh, really works on your lats, your back, uh, strength, and your pulling strength. No update on the Kool-Aid, it's clear. Didn't see that coming. And it tastes a lot better than it smells, so I can do it. Glacier Cherry, thumbs up. Time to hit the Metcon, here it is. 14 minute AMRAP, 70 double under, seven muscle up, seven snatch, 155. Sue, how many rounds are you predicting in this workout? For, for me. For you? Uh, I think in, what, 14 minutes? Yeah. You should shoot for three. Three rounds, can't, can't disappoint the coach, I gotta do it. Three rounds, guys, let's do it. Muscle-ups got to me quick, and I was just struggling hard. I just didn't have it, and it sucks, but I know it's something I need to be working on, and it showed right there. Did I you failed. do better or worse? I failed you. You failed me? It's all right. I failed you. I still love you. When you're a CrossFit OG like this guy, you, you stick to the roots and split snatch, baby. Freestanding handstand push-ups so much harder than they look. Hey, Stu. Have a good one. See you tomorrow. See ya. Turkey burger, brown rice, and quinoa. Real original. I'm gonna sit down, start editing the vlog, eat my dinner, and then I gotta get to bed because I gotta get up early in the morning to go train before I go out of town. So, I'm gonna sign off here. We'll see you guys in the morning. Have a good night.